lining up to come into lunch, if there was a seventh or eighth grade class before them or even after them, they wouldn't be passing each other in the hallway. And then we usually bring them right. When we're thinking about the school within the school, really we're thinking about it being a bridge between elementary school and the middle school where there are going to have more teachers, more rigorous content area. So building principles, um, the times and let me see if I see the bell here this evening. So we were hand ten last evening, but we we have been working together to actually put together a design in which students can have a, a school design within a very large building. That would be solely their own use for things. That would be their own schedule, their own teachers, and their own portion of the building. Now it's not very hard for me to imagine that now because we have that going on here right now. We have Ferguson Elementary within the walls of mid middle school and actually the school within a school design here is going to occur on the same floor that Ferguson Elementary is already in here. Uh, one thing that will be a little different is that we'll be bringing fifth grade teachers here permanently and grouping fifth and sixth grade students together and then seventh and eighth grade students will be together. The fifth and sixth grade design will include two teacher teams whereas the seventh and eighth grade in another portion of the building will have the usual uh, four content areas and encore subjects. Your child will be able to uh, have the same encore subjects or specials um, that they had in the elementary, art, music, and physical education. Lunch and activity times will all be separate uh, from the 7th and 8th graders. Uh, some of the features that we'll have within uh, with our building, uh, we will have the unified arts, which would be art, music, physical education, and uh, possibly health, which will be built into student schedules during the day. There will be a 15 minute recess period. Uh, and uh, we do have Mr. Beaverson here who is our, uh, our orchestra director. We will be offering a uh, band orchestra and chorus to fifth and sixth graders. Uh, in addition, those fifth and sixth graders that are interested uh, will be able to receive individual music lessons. We have a school-wide effective behavior support plan here at uh, Smith Middle School, uh, our SWEBS program. We look at the positive things that students are doing uh, and we reward those things. Uh, for example, we have monthly celebrations for students that have zero office referrals. We have assemblies that focus on character education and we are teaching and reteaching uh, those expected behaviors. We, we have what's called our key and the acronym would be keep your hands and speak to yourself, engage in respectful interaction, be responsible for yourself, and show compliance with school rules. So they're coming up to the third floor, they would, we don't, uh, as teachers, we wait for them, uh, we walk our students to and from lunch. They're not allowed to stay watching. Oh, okay. And there's a little toy school.